Chat, we are going to play okay. a game called Cookie Cutter. Um, this game is a, I think it's a rogue Metroidvania style game, but it's super cool. Um, I don't even think it's out yet, but you can check exclamation point, uh, First, at exclamation point cookie. And from the void came the matter and like a cancer floating within nothingness, the mega structure. Many sought to discover its secrets, but all failed. All, that is, except for Victor Garbanzos. He led the Infonet Corporation deep into the heart of the megastructure and vanished. For years he was gone, Lore. presumed lost like all others. Lore. But one day Lore. Victor returned. He emerged from the heart of the megastructure with incredible knowledge, unbelievable lot, technologies, bro. and immeasurable power. Thinking. To the astonishment of the people, he declared that the worthy would no longer fear death, Lord. that the Infonet Corporation would forever preserve their souls in immortal metallic bodies. Come on, let's get to metallic the 2D fighting. bodies called Denzels. At Denzels. his command, the Denzels built the magnificent Golden City, Mecca to the Chosen, epicenter to all the knowledge and the power I'm of the I'm worried if I skip this lore, it's gonna be all important. All that was 212 years ago. The Garbanzos family and their Infonet Corporation still rule the megastructure today. No one knows what was found in the shadows centuries ago, or the true nature of the power that it gave. But the promised utopia was a lie. The Denzels aren't blissful, eternal vessels for devoted souls. They are the mechanized prisons of industrial slaves, bound forever to the will and whim of the noble corporation. Rebels fight against the tyranny. What a meta. But their that was a very hopeless. meta lore Infinite's right there, Chad. Twisted armies are just too Yeah, this is very powerful. meta lore. My name is Shinji Fallon. Once the engineer at Infonet, I was a part of their machine. And yes. It's out now and on sale. And you can put an exclamation point cookie and, no and then you can you can you can play it. End this. Yes. My only hope is to know what they know. For that, I must follow in their footsteps and journey to the heart of the megastructure. I built my own Denzel, mm. one beyond their control. I've manufactured Denzel before, own Denzel. but this one was different. This it's was creation, not Oh shit! Chat, I'm about to get in trouble for these boobs. As a spark these of anime boobs. boobs. Shit! Something. Something I didn't expect. I didn't even know that I was looking for. She, Cherry, gave life to me. She is my happiness. We shared a beautiful life together, but we still planned to find the truth. We just never got the chance. Because one night, Infinite came for us. <laughs> Oh no, they shot her girlfriend! Oh wait, wait, was that her girlfriend and she built a robot girlfriend? I didn't really pick that up. I didn't really pick up on what happened there. Both? Yeah, that's cool. Same. Gameplay. Oh. 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 This is pretty. Try pumper makes me stop. Okay, I can't use the pad. This is brutal. I'm a robot, it's fine. Although, look at my robot titty flopping around. Please, let her go. 
And why would I do that? Really, Shinji? Does this thing actually mean something to you? Just let her be, Salem. You got me. Please, give her back to me. I don't think so. Hey, dis oh, wait. Dispose of this abomination. They're called deads. <laughs> They're <laughs> like that's their. That's like the monster name. Because their heads look like this. Wait! Oh, 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 Jesus Christ. Lore. Yeah, game over. I was about to say. I think. I think. I think I'm done. I think we're done. Um. I mean, I get what you guys are seeing. But this is a lot to me. There's a lot going on here. She does have some wild, wide childbearing hips. Convenience. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, we're gonna go past that though. Whoa! <laughs> Okay. That area also glows when she talks. Can I like stop? Oh, okay. We got to dive. All right. I got it. You wish you had a talking cooter? Uh, I've been to enough clubs of strip to know that there's definitely some, some people that can make it talk. Okay. Oh I sense danger ahead. Use your quick attack to dispose of this enemy. Cool. Quick attacks don't deal a lot of damage, but they do recharge your void. Your Pay void? Attention to the white bar in the upper left corner as you fight your next enemy. You can spend voids to use weapons and combat abilities your void? to find a new journey. Always more enemy attacks and even hazards. How do I do strong attack? This enemy just dropped bits. Bits? Okay, that's fine. They could drop materials. Okay. Alright, we can use the camera. I wish Mario games had that. Dauntless power fist is able to charge, uh, change size with a blast of energy. Okay. The gauntlet deals great damage, but also consumes void. Keep an eye on your void meter. Oh, I just took 10 damage. Oh, this combat's fun. Whoa. Yeah, I'm into this. Once their HP is critical, just press the heavy attack button when near them for powerful finishes. Once the HP is critical. I want to murder something. Cool. Cool. Murder's cool. Isn't that a talking mechanical cooter? 
maybe. Maybe. <laughs> Seems like it. I feel like you got a good amount of combat options here. Oh, you can parry their attacks? All right. Um, why are, can you not climb up this? Okay, that's not easy. It's not like on, it's after that little, that little like thing is a... Oh, cool. I'll trade void for healing. Um, oh, what was I talking about? Okay, I can slide. Okay. Yeah, the combat's really cool. It selects the map. Yo, Adam, what's up? How's your day? What are you doing this weekend? Raz's backpack. This backpack is so heavy and rusty. It contains some useful tools. Oh, that's what he wanted. Oh, let's go. Edit components? Two extra sales. Yeah, when you're, when you're driving around in your limo, you better thank me for that. It's true, I did, see? Uh, what's this? Let's see if I can read this properly. Biohazard, keep out. All right, let's go. I ignored your jizz comment, which took a lot for you to post. <laughs> for some, you know what, for some reason, I didn't think it, I don't think that took that much, honestly. I think you were ready for that. How did I miss his message above? I was, I was luring. I was luring. Maybe, maybe I just didn't want to repeat it on my advertised stream here. Uh, but at the same time, considering I have a robot vagina, um, I think I'm okay. Is there something we can do to help? You're clearly in distress, how can we help? Just kill you? You're gonna ride this one out on your own? No, let's right. Let's kill him. Oh, I, you know, I feel like we should absolutely kill him. Why would we not kill him? Yes, you're getting paid. I should get paid for that book advertisement I did earlier. Gary, when that book gets made a movie, can I have a very small part? Can I be like in the, can I be like one of the people in the beginning that claps for the stories, you know? That's like all excited about hearing old stories of wartime. and then get murdered by robot because I was lazy. Very small part. As in, first of all, I know you didn't hear that. Uh, because I paid off the proper authorities to make sure that we 
word ever gets out, everyone would be like, wow, that's so impressive. This game is brutal. A blue tentacle. What can I do with that? his brain in. Oh. Very proud of himself right now. He came in. This is this world renowned writer comes in with the two with with two dokes back to back. Why can't I do like a roll and jump? What am I looking for here? What do you all think we're looking for? Uh, I lay these nuts on your face, ampersand D20. What do you, come with it. Either come with it or don't come at all, okay? Gary's gonna be like, I'm coming right now. Feels right to me, I think I just have some fun. Oh, I just ripped that part. Oh, don't die. Please don't die. I died. I legitimately just died right there. I have twice as many viewers as Dane Cook. That actually made me feel bad about myself. To be honest with you. I've also never done a movie where I got to make out with Jessica Alba, so I feel like he's still winning. Yeah, I don't know why, but I feel like I should have way more than double Dane Cook. Yeah. Ooh, what'd I get? What is that? What did that give me? Yeah, I feel like, I feel like that, I, I honestly, I feel a little bit more embarrassed now. Um, like, I think that's how you know if you're doing well. If, you, if people watch more hours of your content than Dane Cook, like if, People are watching more hours of Dane Cook than you throughout the year, and you're f Yeah. Dane Cook is definitely one of those things that you, you look back and you're like, how did that ever happen? Can I knock those guys into there? I need health. I need health. None of that's health. Who the hell is Dane Cook? You're lucky. You're lucky. <laughs> Yo, thank you, Cage Plus. Ah! Let's go. Who are you? In front, you fums. Filthy bastards with big ass guns. You will see that we've got guts to march right over and kick your butts. Mm, okay, yeah, that was not. 
Yeah, that was not good. That was not top tier. I'm just gonna say that. Gary, Gary's the head writer for this game, by the way. Oh. Did I just get murdered by that saw? That didn't seem fair. Yeah, but I can only heal, I can only heal at like certain spots though. Uh, Defy. What's going on? Ow. Ow. That guy just got murdered. Don't jump into the saw blade. Thank you for that advice. You you should go into Whoa, what did I just hit right there? You should definitely get into coaching. Uh edit components. Why can't I edit anything? I need some goddamn components. Uh, jump into the saw blade. Don't let chat tell me what to do. Don't you, don't you, don't you tell me to not let chat tell you what, tell me what. Why am I getting bullied today? Oh, I just blew up that arcade machine. Chat, can I tell you something? Never buy, never buy an arcade machine in your house. It's something that seems like a good idea. It's not. Nailed it? Well, yeah, I didn't have it that time. Are those spheres help? I don't, can't get up to this one. You'll take it off my hands? You wanna buy it? You gotta, you gotta handle shipping. That itself is already a bajillion dollars. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like we're about. What? Whoa, dude, I just got murdered. That thing just did 40 damage. Uh, oh, this is fun. Yeah, it feels really fun. It feels like a, you know, like a nice, smooth, modern beat-em-up. One thing I'd say, maybe, is there's a couple times where I feel like I should not be getting hit. And I am getting hit. But that's probably my fault. I can't dodge in the air. Okay. All right, we beat that, whatever that thing is. Oh, there's another one. Not fair, dude. 40 damage is a lot. 
Not fair. All right, let me go. Will it fit into a flat rate UPS box? Definitely not. Uh, it's a four player arcade machine. You're more than, you're dead serious. I would totally sell it. It's got my logos on it though. But I don't know if you want it. Seven thousand. It's got it's even got hookups for the four guns, light guns. Plus plus your shipping. And you can pay in gift subs. Get some health back, bud. All right, we've got a pattern. Did she just choke him? Okay. Yeah, I feel like we're definitely going to... Okay, let's just keep moving it from this one. I feel like we're definitely going to get a double jump at some point. Cause like, look at that. Uh, okay, so this is still new area. Whoa! Hey, bud. I thought you were, uh... Oh, that's not good. How do I use this? Oh. Oh, you can just press down and do that at any time. I didn't realize I could do that at any time. Is it easy to parry? Not super easy to parry. Yeah, give sub payment plan. Coco! My dog has been going wild all afternoon. Cocaine, come here! Uh, holy gods, who's sneaking up on me around this hour? Wait a minute, are you the courier? Yo, are you blind? Wrong direction, dude. I'm over here. Uh, please forgive her, sir. I assure you we mean no harm. Oh, it literally is coming from her vagina. It literally is blinking right at her vagina. Okay, yeah. Wow. Okay. I'm Regina. Pleasure. I've got a kidney stone the size of a walnut just passing through, too. TMI gross. I think your brains are scrambled, man. We're out of here. Before you go, let me give you a little gift. Take this elevator key card. There's an elevator on the other side of that door. Give it a shot. You'll be able to come visit me way more this often. Don't forget my LED visor. Sweet. Sweet. We can use the elevator. Um, no, it's not super easy to parry, I would say, but... go all right so that brought me down to where I was can I take this all back up yeah yeah 
Regina. It probably is pronounced Regina, actually. You're actually probably 100% right that it's pronounced Regina. I didn't even think about that. Mm -hmm. Let me go down. I want to explore everywhere before we leave. Oh, okay. Bold, cho bold choices. I'm one of your characters after a literal vagina. I, I don't think it's the boldest choice part is probably the large gaping part of it and the face inside. That to me is the boldest design choice there. You slept in? Don't worry, you didn't miss anything. All you did is miss me blow a fucking PB again. Buy upgrades gears. Nothing, nothing. Okay. Yeah, it's just me, me blowing PBs. You don't know what you think about this game? Well, this is a hashtag ad. So I hope you enjoy it. You're getting the tattoo laser removed? I don't blame you now. I'm investigating this location on the net. It appears to be a Denzel factory abandoned by Infront due to an unspecified instance. Instances. Maybe we can find something useful here. I think I was supposed to go this way first because these enemies seem way easier. Robot guys, they just kind of let you kick their ass. The other guys kind of fight back. You didn't know you were allergic to tattooing when you got your first tattoo? Actually, you want to know something crazy? My. The one on my back that I've had for 20 years, uh, like a month ago, blew up and got super inflamed all of a sudden. It was incredibly itchy. I thought I got bit by like a spider, but it was just my tattoo. And I was like, shit's happening. Went away after like two days. But it was like this big, like thick, like perfectly shaped outline D. Swollen. Yeah, the D grew, literally. present with deeper gun i'm obliged to inform you the desert situation link to the production of new denzels drop by 72 percent immediate resources all right lore more lore i wonder they came up with the name denzels um how was it yeah there we go They're Denzel Washington. I don't think that's I don't think that's how they came up with it. But I'm sure somebody at some point said like Denzel Washington? Like that I'm hundred percent. Like when they were going through QA or whatever. And then the guy who made the game is probably like, no, not like them. Void bullet. You always wanted to spit fire from your skull. Well, now you can't press RB to shoot a void bullet. Oh, let's go. Let's go.
cool. Combat on this is really good. So convenient to have an electrical pit in your factory. I mean, you don't have those in your factory. She's a robot. Those, the panties are just for show, I'd imagine. So that's why she's so comfortable with it. Cause she's a, you know, a robot. I don't think she cares. How's the movement feel? Oh, it feels really fun. Like it controls really, really well. It's super stylish. Woo. Where's that? Yeah, let's keep going. Let's keep going. I don't think I don't I don't think so. Oh dear, we're trapped. We really should find a way out of this room. I'm sensing immediate danger. Yeah, well I'm not sensing that it's time to have some fun. Yeah, these robot things are a lot easier than the bugs on the other side. Yeah, it feels like a beat em up game, you know? You spam some buttons, do cool things. I like that I get to murder people. I like that it has finishers. One thing I don't like is I wish that it had, like each enemy had more than one finisher. Like each enemy's finish is the same. Ow. Chat, look where you're going before you just drop down. Absolutely look where the fuck you're going. No, I can't. Oh, I just figured I could shoot through that. Yeah, but I don't have much to heal with. Just wait for me to heal. That was nice. Ow. Mother. Did they just wait for you to heal? That's actually really funny. I feel like that's an oversight. Do I get paid really well to play people's games? Um, I mean, I don't, I don't, here's the thing. Like the money part of it doesn't really matter. I only do them when I think they're like, it looks like a cool game that I would play anyway. You know what I mean? Um, and most of the time it's kind of just like a way to justify playing something new that I might not get the like highest viewership, uh, but I'll think it's pretty fun. And you kind of like offset 
a little bit, you know what I mean? Um, but yeah, some games are bigger than, some games pay more than others. Some games I take less than others. Ah! It all depends on the game. You know? Ow! You'd rather have legs than bionics? Oh, really? You wouldn't want to have, like, bionic legs? I'm, I don't know. Like, are you talking about... Would you rather have real legs or bionic legs? I don't know. I feel like I feel like I would definitely take at least one bionic appendage. Am I wrong on that? Like I wouldn't want to go full RoboCop, but one. Probably an arm. Probably my left arm specifically. Because I'm pretty good with my right arm. One leg wouldn't wouldn't do me really well. Right? Hey man. Stop that. I don't like that. I just died. An inspector gadget? Then, an... then I finally have legs. Get some sick combos in this pretty easily. It's kind of okay. Like the combat has a bit of like um, my friend Pedro. Did y'all ever play that? Yeah, it kind of has a bit of that, like where you're bouncing people up and able, but without the gun, you know, like Pedro's got the gun and the slow-mo. Um, I feel like I don't want to go in front of that while it's moving. Yeah. I like Pedro. That was a fun game. This game definitely leans into all of its all of its campy tropes too. It's weird because it's not it's not like uh, middle school humor, but it's not not middle school humor. Uh, do I play any FPS? Uh, no. I don't really shoot much. It's not that I don't like any FPS games. I just have horrible aim. It's tremendously bad. So, so, so bad. Yeah, I like it. very not hand-holdy at all. D 
Didn't I win a PUBG tourney? Um, I didn't win a PUBG tourney. I just made a lot of money in a PUBG tourney. I think we came in like fourth. Out of, what was it? Fourth out of a rip of squads. Oh, we're not sure the words of our enemies. There's no hatred and justice, no suffering and blood purified by the enemy. A soul does not belong to anyone, not even to the body that contains it. We will come to take your head and finally you will be free, the drifters. Okay. Yeah, you didn't need to kill people to win PUBG. That's the thing is that I, I'm really good at the not getting killed part. That part I was great at in my PUBG experience. Like I was spectacular at the not getting killed part. But the getting, but the killing part, that's where I really struggle. No! Lies. That was a lie. That was a big blatant bullshit lie. Oh, he Kano's him. Or Sub-Zero's him. Split in half. Uh, shooting is expensive in video games or not? I'm just bad. I just have bad aim in video games. Um, I wouldn't say like I, I'm not. I, I mean, not to be anti-American, but you know, I'm not a huge gun person in general. So like, they don't really. I don't know. I don't get the same joy out of shooting video games. They don't make me feel like a badass. Speedrunning makes me feel like a badass. Shooting, shooting games don't. Is that weird? Yeah. I think that's a big, big problem for me. Yeah. Ah, I mean, I'm just bummed we didn't get a... It would have been really fun to get a PB with that sprite, you know? Get up here! Don't make me come all the way over there. I feel like I should have double jump by now. Those things are annoying. My dog better, like, we better have been getting robbed all day. That's all I can say. Like, she I've never heard her bark this much, Chad. Cocaine, yo!
Uh, this is super not linear at all. <laughs> no. Yeah, very, very not linear. It, it even started off like, hey, you can go right or you can go left. Um. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I get for bragging. All right. There we go. It's a bit of a premature celebration. Sometimes you gotta prematurely go. If anyone will understand that, it's it's my new friend Cherry. Ooh, awkward Denzel. Awakened. For this life, I worked down in the crystal pits, digging up electro titanium. My hands were all bloodied and sore from all that labor. Didn't even afford a decent meal. You're a robot. But you're a robot. Oh, my dear sister, you finally made it home. Who the heck are you? Forgive me, my name is Athia. I'm an oracle for Aldenzel. I can help you. Would you like to know who you were in a previous? Yes. Really, you can do that? Cherry, be realistic. This approach used by this artificial intelligence has no basis in science. I don't think you should believe her. Cherry. This is not possible. What is impossible? What are you seeing? I'm afraid I won't be able to provide the answers you seek. The life energy that lies within you is, shall we say, beyond my understanding. I told you, Cherry, you're wasting your time here. I've never seen anything like it. This power of yours is dangerous. It can lead you to greatness, but it can also bring pain and sorrow to your life. You have the freedom to decide who you truly are. That was a... I feel like that's like every time you go to like an oracle... You're rewarded with nothing like that. Any crystal ball reader rewards you with nothing. Let's go. Let's go. Um, today is my third day. I finally found the courage. Process of re relocating the souls of the dead into mechanical bodies is something so... In Wait, what? Wait, what? They're relocating souls into bodies? It makes the stakes seem higher, doesn't it? Yeah, it's like it's like the island. That's lore. All right, that was a cool combination of combat. I think we can all agree on that. Ow. Uh, yeah, this is um, this is the PC version. Yeah, I pretty much play up unless it's like you know Nintendo where I have to play it on the Nintendo. I'm gonna play on the PC for pretty much everything. I probably should not have done that.
Is it bad you're still waiting for the talking vagina part? What do you mean still waiting for it? You haven't seen it? It talks to you all the time. What do you mean? Don't worry, I didn't notice it at first either. I was like, that thing looks weird. And then I realized what it was. Double tap and components of dying to increase the range of attacks. Allow Cherry to perform a second uppercut in the air during a multi-hit combo. Okay. I dig that. It does light up. Hold on. I'll, we'll show you. I feel like it didn't let me do a second uppercut there. I also feel like there was nothing there. Yeah, the skirt lights up. I don't... <laughs> I don't know what 13-year-old boy was developing this game, but... <laughs> do here um, I was polishing up silos my attention was captured I don't need any more lore So that opened up that. Uh, thank you, Vandal, for four months. You are a fine human, um, gorgeous beyond belief. And I greatly appreciate you. like they can't get it's like if they don't aren't so close to you they just do nothing ow I just walked right into that one Robots are just shy. I mean, they, you know, it's like T-1000. He just kind of waits around until he sees John Connor. Kill this guy again. These ones in the upper here are annoying. A group. If you can group people up, it's so much easier. That's like the entire combat. Uh, 
Uh, do I play the game before taking the ad? Uh, no, because, I mean, a lot of, like, what I do is, like, here's my first time ever playing something, right? And I want that to be real. Um, no, I usually... I usually look at it, though, but, I mean, I've played enough video games at this point to know which type of games I'm going to like and what I'm not going to like to a general degree. But that, like, doesn't mean that, like... There's never games that like sneak through that I'm like, oh, that's that's pretty woof. But I think you guys can tell when that happens. Um, I also have it so like if I don't like it, I can stop playing. And just take, you know, a percentage of the money. Usually like 70. Because I never play them again. Uh, that's different. There's a lot of games I play once and never play again. But, I mean, I don't think any game... Like, not every game is a game I want to finish. But I don't... I actually don't think that is relevant. A lot of time, chat... Chat is... Um, what do I want to say? I gotta save my low viewership numbers for iRacing. <laughs> yeah. Uh, like Sekiro? I don't like Sekiro. Sekiro is an example of a game I definitely didn't finish. LED visor. Yo, let's go. I got it. Go save that blind man. Woo. Yeah, I don't know why I couldn't get into Dave the Diver. Some people like Dave the Diver, and it just wasn't for me. There are some games... I tell you, there's some games that I can get into. There's some games that chat can get me into. There's sometimes chat hating a game makes me not like a game. I don't know. Lots of things can lots of things can determine it. Um I have some miracle will allow you to read these words. My time in this factor is coming more and more unbearable. Inference madness is piercing my brain. I'm afraid I won't be able to save myself. My superiors observe my behavior. Surely they understand my acidity and see me as a subversive individual. I know they're planning my suppression. Let me make sure that when I'm gone, you and your beloved Adam can save yourselves from this. You must escape the Golden City as soon as possible. Find a way to reach the underground sectors and take shelter from the rebel communities that live there so your soul will not be condemned to slavery. Please do not worry about me, for it is fairly certain that after my death, and during perpetual bondage, my soul will be sustained. The thought of your love... Was she talking to me? Was that talking to me? Uh, Dave the Diver, I don't know. I just couldn't get into it. It just was like... The gameplay loop felt like it was the same thing. Over and over and over again. Which is awesome when the gameplay loop is really fun. Wait, I've been up here. Um, that's not what I meant to do. That was embarrassing. What Lego set are you building? Now that my son's into Legos, it's like the best time of my life because now I just buy myself toys. Like the last three Sundays, I've just like brought out like, oh, Brandon, I got you a surprise. It's just like a Mario Lego set that I wanted.
Yeah, we built them and then we immediately put them in a box and let them let them like destroy themselves. Yeah, I'm totally okay with that. I don't display them. I build them and then destroy them and then they become spare Lego parts. I have no attachment to the build after I build it. After that, it's just Legos. What? Displaying it's the best part? Or reusing the Legos? Heathen? I know. I know. All right. All yours are on display? I know, I'm a horrible human. I'm a horrible human, but I do it anyway. Well, that was the wrong way. You ordered the Ferrari GT3? I almost got the GT3s. They had the, I, oh, I want the McLaren F1 um, set. And I want that Bowser set. That Bowser looks sick. I really like the Lego flowers and stuff. Energy cell, uh, oh, I like that. Uh, where else do I need to go? I feel like that's it. I feel like I need to go back to the other side. Yeah, I love the flower sets. I think those ones are so pretty. I haven't seen a big piranha. I would definitely do that one as well. What is that thing? Huh. Yeah, I would get the piranha. That would That would be fun. I'm glad they're I'm glad they're doing like not just like the Lego Mario like to go in the sets. Like I'm glad they're doing like other Nintendo sets too, you know? Oh uh, how do I travel over that way? Get a white elephant someone got the lego bonsai you know what the problem with white elephants are it's that there's always someone that's getting something really cool and someone else that's getting some shit i know like it's just like did you go last and then you get ipods apple or airpods Cause there's always some motherfucker that's like, I'm gonna break the rule. I'm going way above twenty dollars. There's always some bastard out there, ruin it for the rest of us. I don't know how to. Yeah, I don't know how to empty that thing. I guess. Why is it called White Elephant? I cannot tell you how it got that. You got a gag gif of a tentacle, sexual tentacle from work? You didn't get that from work, right? A 
mean, I'm pretty comfortable with uh, we skill now, but I wouldn't get him that. Oh, if you work at, a, I guess that would make sense. Yeah, you work at Bad Dragon, that would make sense. Ah! What's the most awkward Christmas gift y'all have ever gotten? I, as a kid, got a a video game for a console that I didn't own, and I was just I had I knew I had to be cool about it. <laughs> Not only that, it was like billiards. It was like a bad game, you know. Clearly, like a fucking piece of junk game. They couldn't even get me one. From like a console I own. The secret book? Wait, you mean like the secret? Like a, like, oh, if you believe in it, it'll happen? That book? Oh my God, cocaine -ia. Um, okay. I dated a girl who was way into that in college. And apparently what she really wanted to happen was to cheat on me with her boss at her first job outside of school. Um, but, um, uh, she was, interesting, interesting. Yeah, so she, chat, so I, she, we graduated, or she, I, I dropped out, she graduated. Um, and, um, or I didn't drop out. I was taking like one or two classes, but we moved in together, right? We've been dating for like a year and a half. We had mostly on, there was a little off period. Um, and then she started working at this company. I forget what they did. And then they went on, she went on a business trip with him. And it didn't talk to me for two days. And then it was just like, then it was like, really like, uh, and it was just super awkward. Then it was just super awkward, right? Because like, she wants to dump me because she's, you know, basically start, you know, started a new relationship on this business trip with a married man, right? <laughs> um, but I, but this company, but this company also needs me for their softball team. So I'd be like going and like playing softball and like noticing she's rooting for him, doing everything I can to try to save my relationship. Cause I was like, you know, I was like, uh, no one else is great will ever like me type like blinded you know what I mean I had bad self-esteem back then oh it was a bad oh it was so bad it was a team building exercise oh yeah she did she went on a team building exercise but I mean they got married they got married they have like 42 kids right he left his wife for her. she left me for him you know what I mean it's fine they got married they got a bunch of kids like you know like I, I wasn't gonna give her that light. It worked out for the best. She sucked compared to Gina. Like, thank God she did that, you know? Door's apparently locked to some sort of security measure. You'll need to Shibo's ID. Uh, I forget what the company did. Oh. Your 36 years of experience, you learn that women don't like to be compared to their exes. I mean, not if you're comparing them unfavorably. Uh, 
Uh, me and my wife are not jealous, though. Like, I would say that me and my wife are very... Um, realistic about the stuff. <laughs> you know? Um, like, her only ex-boyfriend has uh, been in our house before. She only has, like, she only has one. <laughs> what a nerd. Yeah, it doesn't bother us. No, she thought it was fucking awesome. She thought it looked super good. She was like, she was just jealous she didn't get one first. No. <laughs> no, absolutely not. She was stoked. She was stoked that we finally had a, a, a viewer finally got a tattoo. Because she's always said, she's like, I see it happen to other streamers all the time, but it's never happened to you. Uh, you were wondering, well, I like your style. Ask for forgiveness instead of permission anyway. Oh. All right. Mm. Memorial plaque, we're all feeling, can you guys hear my dog? Can you guys hear my dog? I am so sorry. Hold on one second. Go, go! You're stuck in this room now. She's going, she's been going loco all day. I don't know what she's losing her mind about. <laughs> Avoid enhancer, uh, void energy flows through you, the greater force. Okay, cool. Uh, yeah, I got a couple things in my P.O. box I need to open. I need to go get them. Not good goodies. Not my goodies. Not my goodies. Uh... Yeah, I can't go up there. Wait until Tuesday? Okay. I will. I'll probably wait until, yeah, middle of next week. What do I do with these spheres? I don't get what these spheres do. They clearly do something. Uh, Octave, thank you for four months. I guess I should go um I feel like I went the wrong way. I feel like I should have Ow. I feel like I should have gone. I didn't find your thing yet. No, I haven't found your lyric book. I feel like I should have gone in the elevator. That's not what I wanted to do. Okay, yeah, just do that. Oh, I give you gore and ultra violence. What's the weirdest thing I've ever gotten in my P.O. box? Um, nothing. I mean, food. 
food is food is the weirdest thing because I'm not gonna I don't I won't use food like you can't send me food I'm not going to use it so don't ever send me food I won't eat it yeah I, people are trying to be nice but I don't want you, I don't want your food double tap void enhancer Oh, let's do that one. What about wrapped warheads and questionable candy packaging? Yeah, no, no, no. Um, that's the F1 symbol. Uh, no, no candy at all. Uh, personally, I just uh, yeah. Okay, so I'll tell you the story. Um, I was at PAX one year. And a girl, not during my meet and greet, but uh, I did a meet and greet at PAX. It was super cool, super fun, had a great time. Um, me, every meet and greet I've ever done, people have always shown up. I've, it's always been really nice, right? And I did a meet and greet at PAX, and a girl the day before had someone give her a muffin, and it ended up having like a fucking razor blade in it. Uh, yeah, like, she bit down. She didn't get hurt, thank God. So, ever since then, I was like, I know. I know, man, some people are just weird. Here's the thing, Chad, it only takes one weirdo to ruin it for everyone, you know what I mean? You can have nine million super incredibly nice person, but nine million one is a fucking weird fucker and it just ruins everything for everybody right that's why we can't have nice things on the internet They, the gods, the cosmos heard our prayers. Um, if only hum humans are reliable. Um, humans as a species are fucking great. Um, but like, it only takes one shitty end. Okay, I'll give you a better example, a better analogy for this, right? It takes a ton of sunlight, a ton of water, a ton of everything to build to for a tree, a ton of time for a tree to grow really high. And it takes like five minutes to cut one down, right? That's it. One person. Um, the same thing in life, right? It's a lot easier. It's a lot easier to tear something down than to build something up. Uh, and that's also part of why progress can feel so slow in life. You know what I mean? It just takes a lot. Uh, it's a. It's. It takes ten years to build something. It takes one second to destroy it. And then the rebuilding it is easier the next time. You know what I mean? Yeah. Hey, Cherry, is that you? Yeah, old man, it's me. There is the talking vagina for anyone that's curious. You can see it lighting up right there. And you can see its face. Um, if you really want, I'll point out um, right here, chat right here if you look at this area right around there okay okay you look at right there and that um that is and i believe the scientific term is called the flappy part um yeah if you, what you, but what you really want to concentrate on right here is that bolt right there. You can pretty much get, you can pretty much get into the entire machine from that bolt. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Gives you the opportunity to rebuild. <laughs> it's a scientific term. Yeah, the flappy part. Uh, I do. 
Oh, you got your LED visor now. Holy God, I can see again. Thanks for giving back my sight. And holy shit, what? Just uh, going by your voice, I thought you were no a petite little lady. And what's that supposed to mean? Well, I mean, no offense, but you kind of look like a truck driver. <laughs> That's fucked up. You do have a rather unique look. Shut up, weird vagina. Where's that friend of yours? Down here, sir. Vagina. Holy God, now isn't that something? You Denzels never cease to surprise me. My eyes are up here, old man. The name's Papa? Go down into my personal storage. You might find something that'll be super helpful. And what do you have that I can use? Down there, you'll find a special machine. Connect to it, and it'll give you a much needed upgrade. All right, all right, all right. Okay, let's go to that area. What the fuck am I supposed to get over there? Her name is Cherry Popoff. Oh, Cherry Papa. Oh, his name's Papa. Cherry Papa, that's gross. That's not a that's not appropriate. Not a not appropriate. Void hand. Able to release her void power and push some enemies in there. Hold B to enter aiming mode. Okay. Uh... Well, I figured out what these are for, chat. Cool. Cool. All right. That makes everything a lot easier. Uh, feels strange watching me. You must visit Twitch more. You should be here all the time. Why would you be anywhere else? I mean, unless it's YouTube. And you're watching me on YouTube. Um, how do I get this up? there where is it where's the ball i'm looking for Kinda has like a little bit of like Hollow Knight graphical vibe. The way animations work. If you attack the garbanzo, do you flick the beam? Y'all, y'all. The, the problem is, I can't. This game is like encouraging this. You know what I mean? That's the real problem. This game is massively encouraging all this. I can't stop you. Yeah, I can't stop you from.
Oh no. No. Oh, it's it's a flowing baby. Get in there. Does it not do damage to enemies though? Oh, it doesn't do damage to that one. Okay. They kind of, yeah, I see what you're saying. They do have a bit of lethal leak too. I like that the environmental stuff affects enemies as well as me. That didn't seem fair. I'm not using the dodge nearly enough. Yeah, I like that animation. Uh, why would I wait five seconds? Why would I wait five seconds, Cookie Cutter Dev? What a what a name! What a name to come in! Why would I wait? Huh? How much of the lore is vagina based? Very very little, but not zero. But not zero. <laughs> Why is the old man's name Papa? Is it Regina or Regina? Can you answer that question, Cookie Cutter Dev? Do these re... Is this gonna recharge my... Ow. My double jump? Second way I said it. <laughs> we, it's a big, it's a big debate. Oh, whoa! I just got wrecked right there. Does that do? I can't tell if that attack does damage or it just knocks them back and just does swag. Question mark buttons. Hey, I, I think everyone's enjoying it. I don't think you need to apologize for anything. What are these enemies called? Out of curiosity. I'm questioning whether you're a dev or you're a social media person. <laughs> now I'm questioning your dedication. Can I name them? You should have just ignored the question. Yes. <laughs> 
Medic, the void is benevolent uh, and its healing warmth is resonating. Shale can. Alright, she can heal faster. Nice. Not like with less void though. It looked like it looks like uh like a worm with like one testicle on its head. Am I wrong? Big Ed. It's one testy worm. It's a one testy worm. Which normally I feel like I gotta say this is like one of the weirdest sponsored streams I've ever done um, Cookie cutter dev because Like normally I'm trying to be you know relatively family friendly and everything else but this game started off like Woof like I was like whoa I knew we were in for a metroidvania but I didn't know that we would have a talking talking body parts. I was just unaware. <laughs> um, well, how do I stop that? There's that thing down there. Definitely don't go this way. I didn't even notice it. Chat had to notice. Chat told me, which made me embarrassed that I didn't notice it. Because I swear I've seen one before. Swear to God, I've seen one. Up to this that circle thing up there you've never seen a UFO you've never seen anything flying that you couldn't identify I think we've all seen a, a UFO have, have, have you seen an alien spaceship? Mm, debatable. Debatable. How do I get up there? Uh, okay, so that's why I can't go up there. All right, where else can we go? Let's go back over here. I feel like I'm, I feel like I'm doing a big circle for nothing right now. Ow. Targeted toward males. Yeah. I wouldn't say that this is targeted toward males. You know what I mean? Like this, like this type of humor is right up Panty Hamster's alley. Mm -hmm. 
do do. This isn't like dead or alive beach volleyball. There we go. This is a new area. Oh, that was not as helpful as I was hoping. From down here, I can see that there's something in the bottom of the toilet bowl. Why did I put my hand in there? So slimy and gross. Oh. Okay. I thought that was gonna be more. I thought there'd be more there. No, I love my mouse cursor right there. Let's see, I can't go up here. There's nothing up here, I don't think, yet. Better Live Beach Volleyball is fun. I can't... Ah, oh, come on! Come on! Why does the map look like fallopian tubes? <laughs> is the punch coming out of her... It's a Regina bot, chat. And yes. You're legally allowed to drink now? Oh, congrats. That's exciting. How's that going for you? 21's the last real exciting birthday. Every birthday past that is just like trying to relive, relive magic that doesn't exist anymore. The big space mammal? You think he's hallucinating? Can we kill him? I know they want to die. I feel like we should just mercy rule them. Oh, he's 21 months? Oh, never mind. The sub can drink now. Never mind. I'm woof. I missed the joke. Coco's by my feet because she's being wild. Oh, whoops. No. All right. Uh, she. Oh yeah, she's at. She's at the door. She probably is whispering. Uh, Fat Black Patrick Swayze, thank you so much. <laughs> I like how the dev comes in here and is like, "Oh no, there's nothing, nothing weird about this game." And then, and then we just get something called. Suck me dry. Component stimulates your intimidation power. Some say there is no better attack than a solid defense. <laughs> it's gotta be so hard running PR on this game. With very little that wasn't. Oh, he said it was almost all vagina based. Oh, I missed that. I thought he said there was very little that was. Oh, my bad. You know what? Fair. Fair. <laughs> The artistic integrity. I wish I could be in the meetings for a game like this. You know what I mean? Like the pitch to name things. Just that. Just the pitch meetings to name things. Well, what are we going to call this enemy, guys? I know that's not how it works, but in my mind, there's a meeting about every enemy, and there's a group of people all sitting around just, oh, what are we going to call this? Oh, yeah, what are we going to call this? Could you make that look more like a giant worm testicle? Hear me out. Y'all ever played Zelda? You know, you know, you know the, the fairy, right? That, that kind of guides you around? Well, what if we had one of those? But 
but it doesn't fly around her. There we go. That's where I'm needed. Let's go. All right. Ow! Yeah, this is like potty humor for adults. Ow, that hurt. Let me just heal. Components. No, don't have enough for that. We could do the suck me dry. Do that one. Yeah, let's do that one. Show Regina and Bob. What do you mean, show Regina and Bob? I've met I've met Papa and Regina. Wait, who's Bob? I don't even know who this Bob is that y'all are talking about. I don't know who, what Bob y'all are even speaking of. I haven't found Bob. I found Raz. That wasn't weird. Zella's gonna come off creepy in chat. <laughs> that was fun. I know, well, it's just like the anime, Twitch just banned the anime boobs and we're over here with vaginas. Uh oh, that was cool. Oh, give me a double jump after that. It killed my momentum. That wasn't fair. It should re, it should re give me my double jump. Rage. Third book, oh, hey, nice. I know who needs that. I like how he pukes before he dies. I don't know why that's visually, visually pleasing. Hey. 
Regina, not Virginia. Y'all need y'all need for Jesus. Um, okay. Okay. Oh. Well, it's pure electro titanium. You'll not be able to break it down with basic attacks. Can't break it with that. Okay. Okay. Are the question blocks supposed to be like what button you press? Let's go. Um... Air dash by pressing. Ooh. Okay, well that's lit. That's lit. Uh, chat, exclamation point cookie, if you wanna play this. Um, this game is cookie cutter. Um, I really, 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 really wanna say uh, thank you to them for uh, running me ad. This is a good spot for me to pause right now. Yeah, it's a good spot for me to pause. Um, you should get this. It's pretty fun. Yeah, I gotta admit, this one's pretty freaking fun. Um, and... Hmm. And yeah, I love y'all. I love y'all very much. Um, I will be on the alt account, I think, here in a little bit for some racing. Um, I will not be streaming tomorrow. Monday chat is the return of Kaizo Ironmon. Oh, uh, uh, uh. what? Monday is the return of Kaizo Ironmon. Be excited. It's not just the return of Kaizo Ironmon. It is the it is chat verse. You are the going to be the trainers. Everyone in chat is going to be the trainers. Meanwhile, I am going to be playing normally, and then you all are going to get to pick what moves are next. Um We'll see. We might have to play this in a, like a fast forward motion. I think uh, this game's really fun. Yeah, this game's really fun. Um, but anyway, I really appreciate y'all. I hope y'all have a wonderful, amazing day. And uh, yeah, let's. Should we see where we're at on No Pixel Q? Let's see where we're at. One eighty four. One eighty four.